Hi everybody, it's Nani. How are you doing today? I'm doing really good. I am back with a, seems like it's going to be a small empties review video for you. I have no idea other than what I can see here on the top, what is in this bin. I throw things in, hubby throws things in, and then I show you. So I'm going to go ahead and just get started with it. Give you my opinions on things. These, definitely, yes. Big yes, 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 yes. I've showed them before. Love them, absolutely love them. They are like the Dollar Tree dupe of the Biscoff cookies. They are delicious, and it is such a better value than what you get in the Biscoff packs. I think you get six cookies in there. These, I believe it's like 32, something like that. They are the caramelized biscuits by the Pally brand, I believe is the name, Pally Biscuits. And it is an 8.8 .8 ounce package. Oh my goodness, these are so good with a hot cup of coffee in the afternoon. They're just yummy, guys. Try these if you haven't. And I have one more pack downstairs and that's all I have. So I'm on the lookout for these again. They're so good. Hold on one second. I actually brought a garbage bag up here to throw it right into it when I'm done. Finished off a pack of my napkins. I was having trouble finding these big packs of napkins. I finally did. I stumbled across in one store. They were stocked, so I did grab two of them. I was having to buy the other styles of napkins in the Dollar Tree, but I found them, so it makes me happy. You get 150 napkins in this package and they work well for me. I don't have a problem with them at all. So we picked them up when we see them. I was thirsty the one day we were in the store and I didn't see any of the Hint Waters on the shelf, but they had them in the, the cooler, the drink cooler. So I grabbed myself one. I really enjoy this and I think this is my favorite flavor. It is the Blackberry Hint and they're zero calories, a 16 ounce bottle of the Hint Water. I love this stuff. Um, I like sparkling waters. I like the flavored waters. And this has nothing in it. There, you know, no sweeteners, nothing like that. It, And it's hard to describe this. Unless you've had it, you don't taste it overpowering. You smell it more than you taste it. It's very strange. But if you haven't tried these, try them. I, I love this and I love the Blackberry it's my favorite so I was very happy to see it in the cooler that day so I grabbed one of those and drank it what is this my toothbrushes I needed toothbrushes and I picked up a pack to put in our travel kit and hubby picked up some that he wanted that were in the firm strength whatever you call it these are the ones that they had um, caps the like travel caps on the ends I like these a lot and it's the reach and these are this is the reach essentials and these are soft. To me, it, the, the strength of it, grit of it, whatever you call it, it really doesn't matter to me. And these were soft and I like them. They work well. So I picked up another pack. Finished off a 13 pack of my Sure Fresh, sure fresh Zippy Bags. These are what were in the gallon size. And this, as I've said before, does not have the little slider thing. These you just kind of run your fingers across yourself and do it. You get more when it does not have that slider. So I always look for those and these work great for me. These aren't the freezer bags. These are just the refrigerator storage type bags. I love these a lot and we pick them up all the time in the gallon and the quart. I don't know if there's a quart one in there or not. Finished off a thing of the plastic wrap. This is the 80 square feet, the Sure Fresh brand. BPA, I'm stuttering guys, BPA free and it says compare to GLAD cling wrap and it is 80 square feet. Guess I said that. I don't mind this. I don't have a problem with it. All plastic wrap gives me problems. It doesn't matter what the brand is. So I pick this up when I see it. I don't use a lot of plastic wrap anymore. I, I buy those little shower cap bowl covers. I use those. I use containers don't use a lot of the plastic wrap so one of these lasts me for a very very long time but I don't mind it at all it, it works just fine <coughs> oh 
I was going to say, sorry, I need to cough, and it came too fast. I'm sorry. I needed to cough. This is the Breckenridge Farm, the French onion dip, and it is a one pound, 16 ounce container of the French onion dip. Hubby picked this up and he said it was okay. He'd buy it again. I didn't even try it, to be honest with you. He, he likes using this kind of stuff in his low carb, wrap, low carb wraps and he d didn't mind this at all. So he said he would pick it up again. But I can't give you a review because I didn't even taste it. But it's the French onion. So yeah. Finished a thing of the elbow macaroni. This is the Columbia brand and it was a 20 ounce box and it said 25% more free. Always look for the bonus sizes because you see that quite often in the Dollar Tree. We like this brand. It works well for us. It's you know comparable at, to the name brand pastas. Works very, very well and this is in the store all the time, this brand. So finished off a box of this and we'll buy it again because it's great. Their Texas toast, absolutely love this. We buy their Texas toast all the time and you got four thick slices in this box. I believe the regular garlic flavor, you may get six. If I'm not mistaken, if you know that, correct me if I'm wrong. We buy this all the time and even with four, that is so, it's too much for me and hubby. We could make just one slice and cut it in half and we're good, you know, if whatever we could have two out of here four servings just it works great for us it's plenty we get way than way more than one serving i am having trouble with my words today guys i <laughs> i'm a mess i don't know but this is very very good if you haven't tried their texas toast garlic bread whatever you want to call it from the dollar tree give it a try it's delicious i'm going to throw this over there somewhere the Pillsbury traditional vanilla flavor cake mix. Hubby's been using these quite a bit in his Saturday snack videos. This is my favorite cake flavor. I love vanilla cake. It reminds me of how wedding cakes used to taste back in the day when I was a kid. Do you know what I'm talking about? Wedding cakes had their own unique flavor and this reminds me of it. So I like these a lot. It is the Pillsbury traditional vanilla just a cake mix. We like them. They're great. Let's see what's in here. Finished off a thing of the Ajax, Ajax Extra Clean Laundry Packs Mountain Air Scent. It was 16 packs in here. I really like this. I like it a lot. Hubby likes it a lot. He said even he noticed in his dirty clothes from in the garage, taking care of the yard, taking care of the vehicles, he said he even noticed that they seem cleaner the scent is very nice, not overpowering. He really likes this, and so do I. It works well. And most of the time, you only need one pack. It says on the back that if you have a super big load or a super dirty load to use two pods, I don't. I use one, and it works just as well with one. So I think it's a great value. 16 in here. I haven't seen it, though, in a very long time, so I keep looking but haven't seen it. I finished off a thing of the Sassy and Chic nail files. You got four nail files in here. Are these the greatest? No, but what I like them for is I keep one in my purse, I keep one in the travel bag, I keep one in my makeup bag, just to, for a quick file, for maybe cleaning your fingernails underneath, that type of thing, just a quick, quick use. I like these, they work well for that. For a a big job of filing, no, they're not going to do it. But just for a little quick job, they work great. So I always keep a pack of these on hand, so I need to pick up another one. Let me see here. What's in here? This we had in the freezer and finished off. It was the Frigo, Frigo cheddar cheese, shredded cheddar cheese. And it was a three ounce Hubby used this for something, and probably in a, a chicken salad that he mixes up. And we got, got it out of the freezer to use it. And it, it's real cheese, guys. This is real cheese, this Frigo, Frigo brand. Oh my goodness, the, my words, they just won't come to me today. But this is very, very good. And it does come in other flavors. I'm not sure it's in the store right now. So I'm gonna have to check on that because this was in our freezer. 
and the expiration date on it was December of 21 so I'm not quite sure when we bought this but it's good I finished off a thing of the Spa Works, the Pore Refining Cleansing Facial Wipes. I like these a lot. Did I notice a difference in my pores? Not really, but I did save one in here to show you. I liked everything else about these. They were nice, oh, I guess there's two in here. They were nicely moistened, but not drippy, drippy wet. But can you see the thickness and the size of these wipes. They are so thick and so sturdy and big. I enjoy these a lot. Just in the morning after I wake up, before I put my makeup on, I would wipe down my face with these and they feel nice. They didn't dry out my skin. I really, really liked these. And it was the Spa Works and this was a big pack. How many was on? There was 40 it's kind of shiny. There were 60 wipes in here. I was going to say, I thought there was more than 40 because it seems like I've been using this package forever and I haven't seen them since. I hope they come back with these because these were very nice. I have another really big pack of an, something else downstairs that I haven't opened yet. I was wanting to get these used up first. And now that these are gone, I'm going to open that up. I will finish using these too, though. Very nice. If you guys see these, pick them up and give them a try. Like I said, I didn't notice, I didn't notice much of a difference for pore refining, but everything else about them is nice. I'm going to close this back up, guys, so they don't dry out. Let's see, what else is in here? Finish the thing of goobers. I haven't had goobers for 20 years. Saw them in the store. My shirt is all bulging down there haven't seen them but I saw them and I don't know if I've ever seen these in our stores before so I picked one up and I also picked up a box to put in the the um, movie night basket that I'm making these are so good they're milk chocolate and they're it's over a dry roasted peanut ju not just a plain peanut these were really good it probably took me about a week to finish off this box but they were delicious so they're good I like these movie theater packages. I, I think that's a great deal. What was this? Let's do this first. Yep, finished off a thing of the Christmas tree peeps. Love them. Absolutely love them. I love peeps. Can't wait for Easter to roll around to stock up on peeps again. I love them. And there were three little Christmas tree shaped peeps in here. Got a bunch of them to put in, in Christmas baskets and Christmas stockings and gifts and things like that. They're they're cute. and. It's either you love them or you hate them, but I love them. This. I want to like these, but I don't. I did not try them in hot chocolate. It's why I didn't throw them away. I thought maybe I'll try it, try one in a cup of hot chocolate and see how they work. But these are the Sweet Christmas Marshmallows by the Columbina Company. You get three different shapes. And they are, it's a 5.1 ounce bag and they are vanilla flavored. I don't know, guys. I just, I don't know. They're so cute. They have Christmas trees. They have a little, a little snowman. And I believe the other shape is a candy cane. Yes, it's a candy cane. These would work great if you're making gingerbread houses. I just wasn't a big fan of the taste. When it comes to how they are, the, the texture of them is amazing. I just, I wasn't a big fan of the taste. So I don't know. What do you guys think? Have you guys tried these? And what do you think? I, I won't buy them again. I know that. I really won't. But I'm not going to throw these away. I will, I will try them in hot chocolate. And then I'll end up passing them along to the grandkids. And the last thing, guys... It was the Nobleman, the Cucumber Under Eye Pads with vitamin A, C, and E, and you got one treatment in here. So it was, you know, a little pad for under each eye, and that was it, only one treatment. I like these. I like them a lot. I will be on the lookout for these to stock up and have them in my stash. I know they're, they're branded and boxed up for men, but what's the difference, really? 
I and I saw cucumber and I thought that was amazing. I rarely see cucumber iPads for women. So when I saw it, I grabbed I did grab two boxes of these. I haven't used the second box yet. I like these. If you see them and you like doing iPads under your eyes, pick them up and try them. Ladies and gentlemen, these work very, very nice. I also picked up a box of the the pore strips for on your nose. I haven't tried those yet, but I will. Probably in my next empties review video, you'll probably see those. But these are nice, guys. Give them a try. You need to pamper yourself every now and again. And I've been trying to get better at that for myself. I, I used to. One day a week, I used to call it a me day that I would just... Of course, I'd make supper and that type of stuff, but I would take some time just on me. I would take a nice detox bath. I would deep condition my hair, give myself a mani and a pedi and a facial and the whole bit. And then I kind of got away from it and I need to get back into it more. Once a week, I've been doing under eye treatments. I've been doing face masks, that type of thing. And I really enjoy it. So I'm going to try. That's my, my goal for 2022 is to start spending more time pampering myself a little bit but these are nice if you see them give them a try so that was it for this empties review video it was longer than what I thought I hope that I gave you some good good opinions but like I've said these are just my opinions you guys you know we all have different tastes we all have different smells we all like things that others might not so you know it's worth giving it a try for a dollar why not check things out so anyway guys you might see me in this shirt for a couple more hauls because I don't feel like running up and down the steps to change I think I have two more videos to make but I'm not sure what order these are going to come out so don't mind me if I'm in the same shirt I'm gonna get off of here I'm gonna get this stuff put away and work on the next couple videos have a great day everybody I appreciate each and every one of you you're the best I'll talk to you again here really soon. If, if you like this type of thing, subscribe. Hit that subscribe button right down there. And if you click on the little bell, you'll get notified of any of my future uploads. But please subscribe. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. Have a great day, everyone. And I'll talk to you again really soon. Peace.